Hi everybody, welcome to Jasmine's Way. If you haven't done so already, please make sure to subscribe to this channel. Also, make sure to like, comment, and hit that notification button so you'll be notified each and every time we upload a new video. So, Ellie So is back on YouTube. Yes, yes, yes. I actually am still in the process of braiding my hair. Seriously, I am. Like, you all can see, I just got a little bit left. And I got to get this done, like, for real. But uh, I had to stop because I'm like, oh, my God, Ellie So is back on YouTube. And I actually am so excited about it. Welcome back, Ellie So. You know, honestly, like, seeing Dalvin with his constant collabs, where he's done two collaborations with Miss Nicole, of course. I'm like, and then. Oh, man, so it never fell. Every time I'm trying to edit, here comes something new. They got a new video out, y'all. Man, but anyway. You know, you did the collaboration with her ex-best friend, Deja. I was waiting, as you were, many were, for her to do her video on YouTube. We've seen on Instagram, etc. So, this video is not going to be long. I'm going to get straight to the point. I got my trusty little notebook here. So, um, basically, she did a video with her sister, and it was kind of like a bonding experience, something that they do where they ask questions, um, random questions that you may not think of on the top of your mind that you can find out more things about an individual. So one of the questions that was pulled, her sister asked her was, what was something that I don't know maybe you experienced that happened to you? And I'm paraphrasing this because I'm probably not stating the question exactly the same. But Ellie So brought, brought up basically the fact about her her past relationship, which we know was with Mr. Dalvin, a.k.a. Zaddy Chonk Chonk. And she was saying the fact that her sister doesn't know everything she went through, you know, um, and I'm paraphrasing everything I'm seeing. But we know that because really we still are kind of waiting for the details of what really happened as far as for them to break up. And I know some people are probably like, get over it, who cares, this or that. But at the end of the day, she stated that on her video, so I'm reacting to it, okay? Now, the sister was like, uh, well, when we get off this camera, I'm sure you're going to tell me. She was like, no, I'm probably not because... Basically, Ellie so is ashamed to tell her sister. You know, we that all have been in situations like that, honestly, you know, where we've experienced something or went through something, maybe in a relationship, and we didn't want to tell our family every detail. And I mean, our family could be like a sister or a cousin that's like your sister, brother, or, you know, just somebody just very close to you. You didn't want them knowing that maybe you kind of, I don't want to say lowered your standards or like change yourself to try to see if a relationship could happen. And that's what it sounds like with Ellie Soul. And she said that in her breakup video that she was doing things that were kind of not of her character or trying to be a person that she really was not. And once again, I'm paraphrasing. And it then makes me think about the fact that during Zaddy Chunk Chunk's breakup video, Ellie So got very upset, if you guys can remember, because she said, you're not telling the truth. You're not telling them everything. You're not telling them this or that. And so, you know, Sarah, Sarah. So that was just very interesting. She brought that up. So like I've always said, I still think that Ellie So is dealing with that breakup. Even to this day, I know a lot of people might say, oh, she's moved on this or that. No, she's still dealing with it. Even for her to bring that up, in this conversation of this game saying that you'll be surprised what well, she's still dealing with that because she hasn't even communicated it to her sister who you can tell her her and her sister are like besties best friends she, you know like basically said it that's her ride or die you know and so you know i was just thinking about even with zaddy chong chong's collaborations with nicole of course like i'm sorry i haven't i like i'm I subscribed to Nicole, of course, recently. I really don't know this sister. I really didn't really watch Dalvin's videos with her in the past. I kind of like was watching Dalvin more so from the Ellie when he got in a relationship with Ellie and a little bit before that. So I'm really not familiar too much with Nicole, of course. I saw a few videos, but not like an extensive amount like some people who are like, in the comment section whenever they do a collab like oh we love you guys together oh we this or that well i personally feel like i thought you were bringing something new like i don't mean no harm in that but even if you have her on the channel nicole of course but can't y'all like go outside and do a vlog this or that but the point that i'm trying to make with all of this is that it made me look and feel like you the breakup had to be something really crazy i don't want to say crazy but it's so extreme to the point that you sure are not doing collabos with Ellie So, even though she's your ex. Nicole, of course, is your ex, but you're able to comfortably do collaborations with her. But 
you and Ellie Soda not even talking. It's just sad, but it, it is what it is. You know, sometimes relationships just don't happen, and I don't want people to be like, oh, you keep harboring over this. But I wish one of them would just tell what happened so we could just know the details. And I'm sorry, yes, I want to know the details because at the end of the day, it was a public relationship. Y'all put us in y'all business to that. But I'm just so, so happy Ellie So is back on YouTube. Ellie So, I hope you continue to post videos you know i know she's living her life and probably can't post as much weekly whatever but i hope she like starts posting more because you know she when she comes on youtube okay she gets the views she gets the likes all right somebody calling me i guess that's my cue to go but that's really all i gotta say about this if you haven't subscribed to jasmine's way why haven't you subscribed today peace